Yeah, I mean, it was a great second half for us. Um, I think what emphasized that so much was that the first half was equally poor. And, uh, you know, sometimes it, it takes some some games like this, some poor performances or, or some poor halves where, uh, you know, we as a staff have to then get after the group a little bit. And, uh, you know, we did that at halftime. The great thing is that the team responded extremely well. And, you know, our... our intensity, our attitude, our pressuring, our ball winning, everything was so much better in the second half than it had been for any of the three halves we had played previously and the result was that we were able to turn the ball over a number of times and create some some uh, you know easy opportunities basically. Is, uh, we've got high expectations for him, he's an extremely talented dynamic kid. Um, I think he was sort of he, he needed the tempo of the team and the attitude of the team to be better. Um, you know, as a young guy, he's kind of following along with, with the rhythm of the group. And so far, until the second half, the rhythm of the group hadn't been that good. And so he was sort of falling in line with that. As soon as, you know, other other people around him started to raise the tempo, um, he, he latched onto that and, and he made a massive difference. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, you know, we're, we're trying to figure out what our best lineup is. We're trying to figure out uh, where our depth is going to come from. And I think for those guys, those two freshmen in particular, to, to do that uh, is great. It's fantastic for their confidence. I think it, it gives other players confidence in them. And, uh, you know, I think that that, that whole group has uh, a chance to really help us this year. We knew that we had a good group of attacking players and um, you know it was going to be a matter of putting them in, in positions that would maximize their strengths and, and uh, getting the team to play in a way that would maximize their strengths and, and uh, you know much like our uh, inability to be hard to beat and, and our inability to win balls in midfield I thought that our our attacking group was is as much at fault for not doing as good a job at uh, changing pace to pressure defenders and also at, at holding the ball and connecting in, in the attacking half and you know the entire group of them not just the group that started the second half but uh, the entire group of them did a fantastic job in the second half.